how to use the canister function on the Avid Armor Guide Series Chamber Vacuum Sealers. To use the canister function, you'll need to make sure you have your accessory hose as well as an Avid Armor vacuum canister. To activate the canister function, all you have to do is press the canister button on the top right of the control panel. You'll see that it displays CAN. Now, when you're vacuum sealing canisters, you're gonna want to reduce the amount of vacuum time that is used, so that way you don't break or crush a canister from too much vacuum time. So to do this, we're gonna press and hold down on the canister button for three full seconds to get it to switch over to the vacuum setting. So this means external vacuum, 15. We're gonna reduce this to 10 seconds by pressing the minus button and then once you have that time set, we're gonna press the canister button again. Now, all we have to do, now that we have that set, is we're going to attach the accessory hose to the accessory port on the back of the chamber. And then we're gonna place the other end into our vacuum canister. Make sure that the dial is rotated to seal. You may have to press and hold this just to make sure it creates a vacuum, but to get it to start, we're gonna press the uh, check mark button. That's gonna start the canister cycle. It's gonna run for 10 seconds and vacuum seal this canister. Once it's complete, the pump will automatically stop. Then all you have to do is remove the vacuum hose, make sure that the dial stays rotated to seal, and now your canister is completely vacuum sealed and ready for storage.